When you go to subscriber.com, the first thing you're going to see is this landing page. It's going to have all kinds of information about what this community is and the kinds of things that we do. And if you scroll to the very bottom, you can choose a plan. So there's four plans currently up as of uh, this recording. Three of them are paid and they get all kinds of things like seeds and propagation instructions. But uh, you can also get access to all kinds of resources, including the hardy plant list by clicking on the seed membership. Uh, you can see here that it's free. And if you click on access, it's gonna ask you to create a free account. And that is going to bring you inside Subscriber. And when you make a free account and you access Subscriber, you will see on the left-hand side here that we have a few categories. Uh, you have access to things like feature members, some information on the donations that we've uh, provided as a group. And then here is data. And so we have quite a few things in here and it's being built out all of the time. Uh, but if you scroll down, you're gonna see one that's called Hardy Food Forest Plant List. And in here, you're gonna have access to um, all of the hardy uh, plants in this inventory. There's a, quite a few ways of being able to uh, look at that data. And so we can just view the entire list as is. So here is the entire thing. Uh, so let's just pick one here. This is a, a yucca, it's actually native to Alberta. Um, but if I click on this, we're gonna have some information about this yucca. Uh, as well as some of its edible, edible components, what its hardiness zone is, and where you'd find it in a food forest. We can even open this list in some different views to be able to see it in some different ways. And so this year we're seeing our genus species, family, common name, uh, descriptions, uses, USDA zones, forest canopy layers, and um, anything that has uh, a propagation lesson within it. We can view this in... Uh, this information organized differently. So here's the same list organized by food forest layer. So here's all of our uh, overstory or canopy plants. Here's our understory plants. Here's our shrubs, uh, herbaceous plants. So things that die back to the ground typically. We have our ground covers and we have uh, plants that have like edible tubers. Oh, and let's not forget our vine layer. Uh, scrolling to the left, here's the same information organized by USDA hardiness zone. So we don't have a ton of zone one plants on here, ironically. Uh, but these are all zone two plants, zone three plants, zone four, zone five, and pawpaw, jujube, quince, peach, all zone, all zone five plants. Uh, we can also take a look at the same list of plants by their edible. Uh, qualities. And so here they are. Here's all the fruit producing plants. Here's all of our nuts. Uh, plants where you'd consume the seeds, uh, edible flowers, edible leaves, quite a few in there, edible stems, uh, bark, and shoots, uh, and edible roots. And so things like juice and artichoke. So this is really just like a bunch of different ways of viewing the same thing. So organized by what you can eat, organized by hardiness zone, organized by forest layer. And then here's that entire plant list. Uh, but essentially this is free. Um, you can uh, get access to this as a free membership of a uh, subscriber. You can even, once you're in here, um, add a plant to the list. And so if you see something that you know of that's not in the list, you can click on this and and um, go right in and add all of these details, uh, add the plant, and uh, it'll be vetted, and then it'll be added to the inventory. So hopefully this can be a resource for folks who are interested in hardy perennial plants in general, but especially for those who are interested in doing a little bit of food forestry, edible landscaping. Uh, I'm hopeful that this list will be uh, exceptionally useful, especially as it grows. So uh, here's the list. It's growing. Um, hopefully you find it useful, free for anybody who joins a uh, subscriber at any tier, including that free tier.